It's your boy Marcus. Today we're doing a Goodwill haul video. Hopefully we find some great items. They got new rules here. I haven't been this year yet, but we'll see what's going on. If you like those kind of videos, stay tuned. Look at my other videos, subscribe, give me a like, and let's do this sourcing. Check it out, they got new rules now. At 7.30, they're gonna come give me a ticket, and then I come back at eight to 10, and I'll get to go in there and shop, which is cool. All right, so now it's not, it used to be, you just come get in line and then there's 75 carts and you go in there and shop. But people were staying in there all day. So there'll be people in there all day from open to close. I only stay there for like two hours at most anyway, a couple hours and I'm gone. But there'll be people in there staying all day. So that's why people waiting in line that didn't get a chance to get in because people were in there shopping all day. So I think it's better this way and it's fair for other people that want to go in here and get these great items for the low that they get a chance and it's not blocked by people staying in there all day all right so i think it's gonna be a good look i like it you know what i'm saying get you a time slot and then that's that and then you've got a time limit that's two hours it's not like the other orange county one you only had 30 minutes at that one so you better be grateful and thankful they're giving you two hours eight to ten all right so that's what it is. They got the new rules cracking off over here in L.A. I heard they've been doing it in other cities already, so we late to the game. Anyway, I think it's a great deal, and I think it's better for everybody to get a chance to come inside because all those people just staying all day is not right. So that's what I think about the situation. All right, so you got different times you can come. You can come at 11 to 1, 2 to 4, 5 to 7. I'm going to do the 8 to 10 and see what's cracking. All right. Goodwill Benz. Outlet. The best spot to be per pound. If you're trying to find some product to flip online, this is my number one source, I would say. For real, for real. Yes, golden ticket, thank you. Yeah, I got my golden ticket. This is the line. See, I'm right here. I'm right here in line. One, two, three, four, five. Number five, ain't nobody about to about to try to cut me. I got footage, bruh. So it's a few hours later. We're on the way back to the Goodwill Benz. Um, my time's coming up. I got the 11 o'clock slot. So I get two hours to shop. They don't change the bins anymore. You just get two hours. And I heard people be trying to cut and whatnot, but We'll see what happens when we get over there. And the lady already knows. She seen me early in the morning. I've been there, so ain't no fugazi stuff going on here. I got footage too if they wanna see some, if they wanna get real technical, but we shouldn't have no issues. And let's see what's going on when we pull up over there. Look, it's thick. Crowded. So, yep coming back looks pretty crowded out here make sure you stay to the end i'm going over all the items that i did get from here i had a good haul no 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 and we're in here this guy was rushing but it is very important to rush when you're first in you got to get to as many of the bins as you can uh to have the first look at it so I'm in here going super fast, trying to get the first look at as many bins as I can before more people get a look at it. That's how you find the gems real quick. And then as you go on, you can slow up. But at the beginning, try to get as much bins hit up as you can first look, and then you can slow up later. But you gotta look very fast at the beginning. 
I stay to the whole time. Most people, you know, don't stay to the whole time. They just leave after they look at, I guess, a few bins. I keep on going until I find everything I need to find. I'm in no rush, only in the rush in the beginning. Here's one piece that I found. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Finding great items for the low. As you can see, a lot of people left. There was more people than this, but I stay my two hours and then I leave. If you want to come back, you got to ask for the new ticket. And if they have availability, you can come back. Only $35 spent. Welcome back to the crib. We made it back. Another successful day at the bins. It was good. First time back this year with the new rules and everything that's going on. Let's break down what I found. Spend an hour and a half in there. Um, let's break down what I got. So first of all, I spent $35. That's all I spent on today's trip to the thrift. Goodwill Benz, my favorite spot. Pull so many great items there. And only $35 spent. Let's get into it. All right, first up, Adidas. All right, this is a girl's zip up. Nice color wave, nice flowers. This is like springtime right here. Straight up, nice, great condition. So Adidas track jacket, I got two of them. This is the first one. Here's the second one, the blue one. They both hit crispy. I'm liking them. These are for the girls. Nice right there. Next, Motley Crew. No, this is Kiss. Kiss t-shirt. This tour was in 2015. It was marked up with paint. I don't know why they did this. The tag is junk food. And this was a tour t-shirt. So they painted it. I don't know why, but it's a tour t-shirt, Kiss 2015. This is a Harley Davidson shirt but it's from London. So this is sell pretty well. It's a London Harley Davidson t-shirt. You see the London back hit, nice color wave, nice print. Same on the front, pretty good shirt. Next, I got Motley Crue. 2011 Motley Crue t-shirt. Pretty nice. I'm not sure what size it is. It looks small. I'm just gonna say it's a small. Next, I got a Black Keys. Black Keys t-shirt. Grateful Dead. This is like a girl's crop top. Grateful Dead though, this is, this is hard. Look at that nice print on there. The tag, Grateful Dead. This is hard. This is a girl's crop top. Nice. Reebok. Got a vintage Reebok here. Looks to be in great condition still. Nice bright colorway. Size extra large. Nice vintage Reebok here. What is this? Some type of Cleveland, Ohio fire, firehouse. It's a firehouse shirt, but it has a nice back hit. Green, Dodgers jersey. It's a patch jersey as well. So patch jerseys are, can sell more than uh, just a regular print. Some Nike shorts here. Looks vintage. It's on a red tag inside. Has pockets. Some pretty nice Nike shorts. Trout. 
Farrell's restaurant. This is a Farrell's restaurant, the California restaurant we have out here. Mike Trout jersey. Buffalo Wild Wings. You know I'll be selling that Buffalo Wild Wings gear. I found another shirt, V-neck. So they went away from the jerseys. They started doing shirts. This is the Burbank. Burbank out here, California, bomb squad, whatever. Hopefully it sells, somebody needs it for work. Cubs, little pool over here, nice, con nice condition. Uh, what is this? The mountain, all right? Anything that has like an eagle should sell. It's like Harley Davidson style, has a nice print. Derrick Rose, Derrick Rose, Chicago Bulls. He just got traded to the Nets, actually, right now. Not the Nets, the Knicks. All right. Aruba. Aruba t shirt. I haven't been to Aruba yet. I'm going to go check out that island soon come. Notorious B.I.G. All right. Notorious B.I.G. Ropper. Nice collared right here. Just like Native American style. And it has, look at the detail on the buttons. So, this is a nice shirt too. Chipotle. Y'all know I'll be selling that Chipotle shirts too. Got another one. Chipotle. Somebody needs it for work maybe. Or it can just be a fan. Fashion Nova hoodie. All right. This says Cardi. I don't know if Cardi B had to do with this or Cardi or whatever. Fashion Nova hoodie. Joe's ladies jeans. Joe's jeans. All right. This is what the name brand looks like. You can see. These are good jeans for the ladies. All right, Levi's. Got these Levi's here. Nice, large, good size. I mean, good colorway right here. Nice, nice wash on them. All right, so that's all the items I've got that are clothing from the Goodwill bins. And I got three VHS's. All right, Power Rangers. This is from 1995, uh, so that's cool. Power Rangers, I remember Power Rangers back in the day, that used to be my cartoon boy. They was legit, straight up. Power Rangers, so I got that. Got my Rugrats, all right. I don't even remember this movie. Like, I don't remember the movie, I'm gonna have to watch this. Rugrats the movie, I don't remember it. And uh, The Land Before Time. All these throwback VHS's, you know what I'm saying? They're selling pretty well. Um, Cause these is like classic. I don't know about the Rugrats classic, but the Power Rangers and the Land Before Time, this is super classic right here. I remember watching this as a little kid. This is crazy. Dinosaurs. All right, so that's it. Make sure you like the video, share the video. Hopefully this helped. Go out there and source. Hit up the bins if you ever. Hit up the Goodwill Bins outlet if you've never been before. It's a great spot, trust me. Go out there and get it. And I think these are my two finds of the day. I really like this crop top right here, Grateful Dead. I really like this one. So this is the find of the day. And then these two um, Adidas track jackets. Those are my favorite from today. Like, comment, subscribe. Do me a favor and do that. I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.